All right, adventurers, welcome back to All Play. We're here with more of the Pokemon Soul Silver Nuzlocke, and we're actually getting ready to continue on our journey. We've had a few events happen that kept us from moving forward, but we're finally, finally going to move forward. How are you feeling, Perry? What you see? He's wandering around. Well, we got one of those Pokemon. All right, so we're finally leaving Mahogany Town, heading east. In the Route 44, which is our first time here, which which means if we had a, a wild Pokemon encounter, we get the opportunity to catch something. It's been a while, but now we got a battle here. I'm going to win for sure. Do you know something I don't know? Because you ain't going to win. You Oh, he's a he's a psychic. I get it. He, he, he foresees a win. You better foresee this here, uh, this, this here, uh, this here Aqua Jet. Uh-oh. Hold it, Pit. Revenge! Oh, no! Damn, Perry! Okay. Okay. <laughs> that is not how we're starting this episode, that's for sure. Perry, good work on the crit. Need you to take a break. Holy hell. I was not expecting revenge. A mining? Yes, we are definitely switching. One of you, one of you clowns. I think it's Scavenger, right? Yeah, Scav, Scav knows much shot. Holy hell! Was not expecting that to be the start of this episode. You would have told me last episode. I'd be like, yeah, I believe it. No, not today. I woke up today saying, you know, it's gonna be a great day. I'm gonna go to the school real quick. I'm gonna do some Pokemon. And we're gonna, we're gonna run shop. Was not expecting us to almost lose Scav in the very first attack of the episode. That is kind of scary. All right, Scav, here we go. Give it a give it a good old crunch. Give it a good old crunch. Come on. There's the copycat. It copies the last move used, which is crunch. And that's also why it, copy it had a mud shot last turn. Uh, we can't super fang it to death. You can never... Super Fang something to death. I don't believe you can. Super Fang is meant to always take out half of the target's remaining HP. So even if they're down to one, I think, and I think it's rounded down. So even if they're down to one health, you can't kill with Super Fang. I don't believe you can. I could be entirely wrong. I've been wrong about so many things through this whole playthrough so far. I could be entirely wrong. Okay, with that battle underfoot, we're going to head back to Mahogany Town and heal up right after we get this here, uh, this red apricorn. We need, we need more apricorns. You never, you never at a point in your life where you have too many apricorns. All right, so we're just going to heal up real quick and then we'll be right back on the, back on the mission. All right, good as gravy. Here we go. I was trying to trying to see on my visual output why why the thing was so loud. That's why I had to bump into those walls real quick. That's my excuse. I'm sticking to it. We got another flame plate. All right, this game and its whole randomized items bit. Not a fan. Not a fan. We have two flame plates, I believe. Yes, I'm not entirely sure, but it could be that they replaced every item. Like, let's see. Let's say there's a potion on the ground early in the game and then there's a potion late in the game. It, I, my assumption right now for what it's set up as is for everywhere there's a certain item, replace it with the same item. Which should explain why we're running into the same items so many times. You, you really shouldn't be having two flame fleets. It's, it's supposed to be a special item for a special Pokemon, but it also works when uh, Pokemon hold it, uh, using fire types moves hold it. Is there nowhere to have an encounter here except for on that grass? I think that that's the case. That might be the case. All right, we're going to head back. We're going to head back to the grass, and I'm going to regret it. I'm going to regret it. I know I am. I know I am. Let's see now. Where was that grass at? There's the water there. Actually, did, what, there's no grass here at all. I, I thought I saw some grass over there. There's no grass here at all. So we'll have to come back once we get a fishing rod. I don't believe we have a fishing rod, do we? It would be under key items. Let's see. No, we don't have a fishing rod. Okay, so once we come, once we uh, obtain the fishing. Oh, shit. Oops. 
Wasn't supposed to cuss. <laughs> Once you obtain a fishing rod, we'll come back to Route 44 and be able to again encounter. You look strong. Good trainers seek tough opponents instinctively. I don't know. If you're as strong as uh what was that? What Pokemon was that even? If you're as strong as a Machop, I don't think I want to fight you. Curlia. Alright. We can take Curly out. We can take Curly out. I'm Metal Claw's not gonna do it. I just wanna use Metal Claw. I feel I feel like using Metal Claw right now. Oh never mind, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Dow did you parry? Metal Claw will do it. Go ahead, parry. Proving me I like when my team proves me wrong. That's how it should be. My team proved me wrong. Heracross, let's switch to good old Let's switch to Scab. I was gonna switch to smells and, and use flamethrower. But nah, let's switch to Scav. Because he's got a double weakness to uh to fly. Or she, excuse me. It's a female hair across. You can tell by the you can tell by the horn. I don't know why I just did that, I'm sorry. <laughs> Scav, I just realized he knows bug break. Please, please kill it. Please. Please, please, please. Go work. Ooh, that crypto. My team today, ladies and gentlemen. I'm proud. I am proud of them. Come on. Go work, Scav. Doing the damn thing. All right. Let's uh, let's book it. Let's book it. All right. Now we're gonna go through what is what I thought used to be the coolest part of this game. Not just this one, but um, Gen Two as well, Gold and Silver as well. The Ice Path, because none of my friends knew how to beat the Ice Path. It's another it's another ice puzzle like we just had in Price's Gym in the Mahogany City Gym. Except this one was actually, it used to be really hard. I think they made it lighter here. They made it not so difficult. Again, these ice, this the ice tiles that Perry and I are on right now are tiles that you don't stop moving on until you hit a wall. So, for example, I'm trying, I'm trying my best to turn out of the slide right now. You can't. You don't stop until you hit a wall. So that's, that's ultimately the puzzle. You need to figure out how to get, how to navigate each of these sets of puzzles. Uh oh, here's our encounter in the ice path. It's a Togepi. That's pretty dope. That's pretty dope. We can't attack it. We will kill it. We can't attack. What we could do is toxic it, but that's that's pushing it. That's pushing it. Uh, let's see. Togepi. Togepi. Let's go for uh. Let's go for a friend. Uh, do I want? I mean, I don't really have a use. Let's go for the friend ball. Nope, didn't think so. All right, it'll be okay. It'll be all right. Yawn. You're gonna put Perry to sleep. All right. Let's see if we can do this this turn. Here's an ultra ball. Hold this ultra ball for me, fam. Dang it, now Perry's going to sleep. Who knows metronome? This is not gonna be good. Vine whip. That was actually a good call. Crit crit! She crit, he crit it. Okay, where's what we None of you clowns know any moves that we can actually use aside from smells toxic. Actually, we can super fang it up. Super fang's not bad. Remember, super fang isn't a strong attack. It always lowers I'm sorry it always reduces the opponent's remaining health by half so theoretically we can't kill Togepi with scavengers super fang it's gonna cut in half okay encore into sleep so in those yawn encore uh, metronome what we're gonna do is we're gonna break scav out of the sleep actually we're gonna leave scav asleep we're gonna try a great ball this time Come on. No good. Nothing doing. Uh, let's let's step it up. We'll step it up one good time. Here's an ultra ball. Oh, by the way, I went to the store and bought more ultra balls. That's why we have so many. Ultra balls and great balls are bent. Yep. There it is. All right. We didn't have to wake Scav up. We didn't have to go for more attacks. We're good here. We got Togepi. Uh, let's check Togepi on the Pokedex. Check it on the decks. Togepi is the spike ball Pokemon. A proverb claims that happiness will come to anyone who can make a sleeping Togepi stand up. That's interesting. 
Togepi. Male Togepi. I don't think I've ever had a male Togepi. Not sure if they're harder to get than the females. But this is Spike. This is Spike the Togepi. Hey, look at that. It's in the right box. All right. Uh, Perry. He's trying very hard to keep up. But remember, Perry's asleep. So we're going to wake them up. We'll wake them up. That way we'll be good. We won't go into any upcoming battles with any surprises. Here's Scav. And here's Perry. All right, let's be out. We are out. We're running out of antidotes. I probably should have looked at the rest of the medicine that we needed. Okay, so here's the next puzzle. Uh, these small blocks are what you have to navigate. Before, it was just giving you an introduction to the ice cave. Um, in case one way or another you haven't been through Mahogany City Gym yet. Here, we're actually navigating a puzzle. I believe I got it. Yeah, that's it. Yeah, that one's not too hard. You just need to pay attention to where the, the pillars are. Relicamp. They have Relicamp here in this in this ice cave. That's actually kind of fitting. It's kind of fitting. Uh, they're based on, was it Cola Camp? Sola Camp? I don't know how you pronounce it. I don't, I, I've stopped caring how you pronounce it. How you pronounce it. Okay, so this is another puzzle here. Let's see, we can go here, here, and here, and we got it. Hey, we got HM07. It's Waterfall. We actually need that. Uh, it's, it's an item that we have to get. We don't have to get it now, but we have to get it before the end of the game, which we're actually approaching. The item you picked up over there, it was an HM, wasn't it? I'm the one who dropped it, but I want you to keep it. You took the time to get it, right? It contains waterfall. Have fun climbing waterfalls. Me? I still need a new pair of shoes before I can enjoy waterfalls. Uh, his shoes are stuck to the ground. That, that's one of the things that they changed between Gen 2 and this one, but they didn't change all the way. I, I actually remember that. He mentions that his shoes got stuck to the ice. I'm not sure if it's the sliding ice or the ice that he's standing at now. I actually remember that one vividly. I was like, yo, just go get some more shoes. Just go get some more shoes. Win a, win a Pokemon battle and then go get some more shoes. It's not that hard. It's not that hard. All right, we're down to the next floor. Now, this one, I believe, is a strength puzzle, and I don't think I taught anybody strength. So we're now at the point in the game where I need to teach someone strength. Let me just double check. It's probably going to be... I might teach it to Victoria just so she doesn't only have grass damage dealing moves. It's kind of dangerous. It's kind of dangerous to have any one Pokemon only having one type of moves. Jigglypuff, they got puffs in the ice cave. All right, I'm here for it. We're not gonna fight you though. We have no, we have no reason to fight you. I also bought repels in case I've run into too many, too many uh wild Pokemon here. Okay, so it's a boulder, but a Pokemon maybe would push it aside. So I have to teach someone strength. Uh, if, if I don't know why I'm in the medicine cabinet. If Victoria is able to learn strength, I'm gonna teach her strength. Let's see. Yeah, she can learn strength. Echo, cool. Echo can learn strength? Excuse me? Alright. Victoria, I'm going to get rid of... I want to keep growth because it's got a nice strategy. I'm going to get rid of Vine Whip. I'm going to get rid of Vine Whip just because it's so weak compared to uh, strength. There's ultimately no instance where I would use Vine Whip over Razor Leaf. Razor Leaf has a chance of inflicting a critical hit as well as is stronger than Vine Whip. So I'm not, I'm not, there's no, there's no situation in which I would optimally use it. So Victoria's going to help us out. This is yet another puzzle. What we have to do is push these rocks down those holes. Um, I'm not entirely sure. Oh, what the rock, I, I know what the rocks do. I was just going to say, I'm not entirely sure what they do. The rocks actually serve just like, oh, come on. I'm explaining things. Just like how there were ice pillars formed up from the ground that I have to slide into from certain angles uh, to navigate where I want to go, that's what the rocks do on the floor below us. So I have to get all four to be able to pass through. Let's see, we can't go that way. All I'll need to do is move this one down. And this one wants to go into the hole on the left side of the screen. Uh, if I push this too far, though, it's over. I think where I want it, where I want it, I want it to go up here, and 
then here. Let's see, can I? No, I can't go that way. That's the only thing. Oh, shoot. Did I mess up? I think I might have messed up. That's the only complaint I have about this game graphically. It's hard to tell where you can and can't walk. I had the same issue when it was the Boutique City Gym. The episode where I was fighting Morty. Let's see. I think I messed this up. Then uh, it's weird because I can't tell. I can't tell what line I'm on. It's not a death. I have a death perception issue. issue but that's not what's happening here. It's just I can't tell what I can walk around and what I can't. Oh, wait. Can I go down? Okay, I can go down this way. Oh, and I mess it up in the last minute. <laughs> okay, so we got to reset that puzzle. All right, we got to reset that puzzle. I'll figure out a very quick and clean way to reset that puzzle so we don't waste too much, too much time. Let's see. Can I? Okay. What I can do instead of resetting immediately is I can solve this puzzle and then go out and come back. So let's see. This one, what I want to do is get the boulder here. And I go on the other side. I end up right here. And I can push it to the left. Then I can get it down that hole. That's on the bottom left of the screen. If we can stop having so many wild Pokemon battles. They got Magmar in here. That's great. It's lovely. Wish you were on the team. All right, what I'm going to do is use a repel. I'm not entirely sure, but this... No, it's, it's excellent. I was going to say, this might be the first repel that we use the entire playthrough. No, we've, we've used repel before, chill. I bought 10 super repels. Why didn't I buy... Why didn't I buy max repels? Because, ladies and gentlemen, it's more cost-effective to buy super repels. It's more cost-efficient, I should say. All right, so we're going to push this one here. Uh, we're going to go down here. And we can push that from this side. And then we come up here and push it one, two, three. And I can go down here, push it back up one. And then we're good. This one goes all the way down here. All right, so that's one boulder done the right way and two goofed up. All right, this one here, we want it to go up. We want it to go up here to the right. Move, Perry. You're in the way. You're fun and all. It's been lovely having you on the team, but Jesus Christ, you are in the way right now. We want to push this from the right side now. All right, that's two. Now we'll need to reset. So very quickly what I can do is just go down this ladder and come back up. This is the room that we need the boulders to fall into. We can see that we have one there where it needs to be. And then there's one farther down. I think I can show you actually. Yeah, it's right here. Uh, let's see. There's two more boulders. We need them on the other side. And we're going to go and do those this time the correct way. Let's see. How would I goof that up so easily? Like I flawlessly goofed that one up. All right. Here's what we can do. We'll need to use strength again, which is okay. It's all right. There's no, there's no issue with using strength more than once, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you, Victoria. Need you, need you, your, your lovely, your lovely vines. All right. So what I can do is push this to the left. Now I come back this way, and I don't goof this up. There we go. I push this down. One. And then we push this to the right. That's three. All right. And now that I know that the room basically is a big loop, I know how I can solve this one. Push this one up. Now I have to go around and push it from the left side. Let's use another repel. Another super repel to be specific. Here we go. We go up here. And then we push this from the left side now. And then we go back on top. And that's all four boulders. Now, we could go down the ladder, but it's more fun to drop down here. Yeah. All right. So now we can finish. We can uh, GTFO because we need to hit this block and hit this block and hit this block. Let's see. I think that top puzzle you actually don't have to solve, but the other three you do. Here's a cherished ball. 
If I'm not mistaken, it makes Pokemon more friendly quickly. Let's see. Cherish Ball. Where the hell did my... Cher is, it, is it a Pokeball? Cherish Ball's a... It's a thing. That's weird. Oh, man. We got a Cherish Ball. You're never supposed to have this Pokemon, just so you guys know. I'm this Pokeball as an item to throw. Honestly, don't think it'll catch anything. It's, it's, it's a special thing. It makes it so you can't trade Pokemon. It's only given out really during um, special events. So it's really weird that I have that as a Pokeball in my items. I hope it doesn't mess up this game. That would be that would be horrible. We made we made such progress. All right. So what I need to do? I don't know why I'm skating around the room like this is where I need to go. I need to get to the middle of the room now. So again, we'll go here, here, and here. So we can go here and we'll go farther down in the ice cave. All right, so this here is a boulder. We can break it with Rock Smash. Rock Smash, please tell me Rock Smash is a, an HM in this game. If it is, we don't have it yet. Weren't we supposed to get Rock Smash? No, we got Fly from uh, Chuck's wife. The Chuck Chuck was the leader of the Cyan Wood City Gym. Where did, I don't remember where I get Rock Smash from. I'll have to, I'll have to go back and get it. I, I don't think it's a mandatory HM. There's always one HM that's not mandatory, and I think that's it. But I'm going to go back and get it because there's a lot of stuff we'd be missing without it. A lot of stuff that I actually want. Let's see if we can get... Okay, I see how we can get that Pokeball, whatever item that is. We'll go here. And then we go here. And now we dip back and we come to the second one and go here. And now we can go to the right. Hey, TM19! Hyper Beam. Is it really Hyper Beam? Or is the game just playing with me? TM19. Oh, yes, it's Hyper Beam. That's pretty dope. That's pretty dope. Oops, excuse me. I got gas. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I was, I'll calm down. All right, we want to go to this ladder here. Go up the ladder. Go up the ladder, please. I think we're on our way out. I believe we're on our way out. Okay, so we want to solve this one. What we can do? Oop, repel we're off. We can go here, 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 here. Okay, it's not going to work. What you have to do is move that boulder up above, down one. After this Poke Battle. After this Pokemon Battle. It's a Magmar. Oh, it's a Magmar. She's got a butt head. Come on. All right. Here we go. Okay, so what we want to do is move this boulder down one space. No more, no less. Come on, Victoria. All right, so now we do that again. Now we come here, 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 and here. We got a dome fossil. Dome fossil. All right, pretty dope. Normally what the fossils have are fossil Pokemon. Um, the dome fossil is normally Kabuto, I believe. Normal, normally it's Kabuto. It might not be this time. Remember last time we found an Eevee in a fossil. So so it is most likely not going to be um, a Kabuto. Hey, there's that woman again. Let's see. Let's see if we can talk to her. Me, oh my. Is that you, Chill? Fancy meeting you here. To tell the truth, my sandals are frozen on the ice and I am stuck here. In other words, my flip-flops are quick frozen to the ground. I, I understood. I understood that. You didn't have to reiterate. It was not needed for you to reiterate. Tee Well, it's no laughing matter. Would you come around and push my back? Sure. All right, so let's see if we can navigate to push this woman's back. We don't know this woman's name. It just hit me. We don't know this woman's name. Another Togepi. We got a Togepi already. Don't even tell us about Togepi. All right, so we're gonna run. It'd be, it'd be all right. Let's go here, 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 and here. And now we can push her. Oh, I, I we had this conversation already. We, we, you reiterated yourself. Yes. Shove. You really are kind. Thank you so much. All right, so we freed her. Let's see if we can get that item while we're here. Uh, in the event that. We we don't have to backtrack. I would prefer that we don't backtrack. Let's see. Am I doing this wrong? Please tell me I didn't have to do that before I saved old girl. Because that will give me the sads. Here we go. 
I think. Let's see. How would I get? How would I get there? To get there, I would have to go from the right side. I'm sorry, from the left side, and hit the block that's below Perry. How would I do that? I need to go from the left side and hit the block below Perry. I can go. Let's see. Oh, this one's a hard one. They gave me a hard puzzle. Man, don't even tell me about hard puzzles. Let's go this way. I really hope I didn't have to do that before. Before finding this woman or freeing this woman. I think that's what it looks like. Nope, nope. I think I got it. Over here. Okay. I got it. We did it. It's the wise glasses. We did it. We did it. What are wise glasses? I have no idea what wise glasses do. I've never. Uh, it it's a thick pair of glasses that slightly boost the power of special moves. So it's 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 a parallel for what's the other item we got for for physical moves. We did get one of those, right? Could have swore. Could have swore we had something that works like that. Oh well, maybe I made it up. Maybe I made it up. Oh, muscle band. Okay, so it's muscle band and oh, wise glasses. That's inner dasnik. All right, let's GTFO. There's nothing else here for us, and we, we can cl clearly see that the door is right here. All right. A, A, I don't know if you guys know about that, but this is my favorite song in the entire game. Blackthorn City and Azalea Town share the same theme song, or the same city music. We made it to Blackthorn City, ladies and gentlemen. Now is as good as time as any to go ahead and wrap up this episode. <sighs> and then we're finally in the city with the last gym leader of, of Johto. So we'll be wrapping it up here today. If you guys enjoyed this episode and would love to see more, and all you have to do is hit that red button below this video. And last that subscribe button, and I'll do my best, do my best to make sure you guys can see more episodes of games like Pokemon Soul Silver, more challenges like Nuzlocke Runs, as well as everything else that all play has to offer. Uh, I'm going to do a little bit of training between now and the next episode. I'll probably just go back in the ice path and do a lot of fighting. Thank you guys for checking this out, and I'll catch you later with more here on Alt Play. We're almost, we're almost done. We are really close to the end. This is wild.